So, my name is Brandon Fitz. I am the director of recreation here in Belmont, and I'm so excited to be here tonight to help kick off this incredible project. That is what, Courtney, seven, eight years in the making? Um, seven years in the making, so a long awaited, overdue project. We're so excited to be here. Um, I'm not going to talk a lot because there's a lot of people that have a lot of other folks to thank, but I'm going to pass it over to the woman behind much of this project. She's one of our recreation commissioners, and and I think you got on the Recreation Commission seven years ago because of this project, and we're finally seeing that through. So everyone needs to give a big round of applause for the famous Courtney Eldridge. I am so glad. I'm so glad that all of you are here to celebrate this grand opening of our playground officially. So the fences came down yesterday, most of them. So you'll notice there's still a couple construction fences up around the parkour area that's not quite done. Sorry, you cannot hear me. Hello. The, constru the construction fences are still up around the parkour area, so please stay out until that's totally ready. But we've got the, we've got the pickleball area ready to go. The basketball courts are ready. The big kid playground, the two to five playground, and we are so thrilled that you're here. I'd like to thank all of you for coming. I definitely want to give a huge thanks to the CPC. Without their funding, this would not have happened. A thanks to all of you donors who supported this project because without your funding, this would not have happened. A huge thanks to the rec department and especially the DPW who oversaw a lot of this project. And with me, I have some of the uh, members of my team who helped in the background to make sure that this project happened. Uh, before I hand it over to Dave over here, I want to see it. Is Maddie on the basketball court? Anyone? Maddie. Well, Maddie over here who's waving is going to throw our first basketball. So after I stop talking, he's going to run over and do that. So I'm going to hand this over to Dave in the meantime. All right. So Representative Dave Rogers, welcome. Hey, it's great to be here with everybody today. Uh, how about another big round of applause for Courtney? Projects like this don't happen by magic. It takes the hard work of people getting involved and the... The Friends of uh, Town Field, uh, as represented by Courtney, did amazing work. The Belmont Recreation Department, the CPC, um, it's, uh, the Department of Public Works. So it was a big team effort, and all of you are part of it as well. I don't want to talk at too great a length because I don't want to get in the way of that first basketball shot. And I'm looking forward to trying the pickleball court. So, again, it's a wonderful day, and it's, it's lovely to be here with all of you. So have a great day. And we're going to hand it over to Brandon. Also, um, before we cut the ribbon, a few other folks that I'd like to thank and recognize. So um, the landscape architect that designed this facility, Tim Wong is here uh, from Waterfield Design Group. So Tim was the architect. Tim, raise your hand. There he is right there. Um, very exciting. And um, Frank Sartori, he is the superintendent of all the parks in town, maintains all this area, and, and takes great care of all of our facilities. So thank you, Frank, as well as Eric, our program coordinator with Belmont Rec, who makes responsible for all the fun programs that you guys enjoy and love. So um, with that, I believe Courtney has given out a number of scissors here. Um, I don't know, Belmont Media, can you guys see anything <laughs> with the scissors? No, sort of, yes, no? Oh, right, yeah, so if you're not cutting, take a big step back, and we'll get a nice picture here. And then after we cut the ribbon, I want everyone to cheer. Wait, Courtney, what else? Okay, so we'll, do, we'll cut the ribbon, and then we'll do the basketball shot, and then the playground will be open for business, all right? So is that all my scissors, all my cutters ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Woo! All right, we got that first basketball shot coming up right now. And the playground is officially open. Enjoy. Congratulations. Well done, everybody. Get a trolley dog. Get some sunglasses. And enjoy the new park. Hi, and welcome to News Now. I'm your host, Maribel Carvajal de Salazar. Today we're here at the grand opening of Townfield. I'm here with Corny. Thank you, Corny, from you. all the children of Belmont. This is a reality. It's finally a reality. It's taken us seven years, and it is beautiful. So tell me, how was the process? 
challenging. Uh, COVID derailed a lot of our timeline. It derailed our financing. Um, that was a bit of a setback. But when you put in that hard work and just stick with it, and you see the playground full of children and grown-ups, and they're all outside in the summer, it is. It warms my heart. Worth it. Worth yeah. it. Every every second of your work, and we're very, very thankful. Of my work. <laughs> Some of them. I'd like to. I'd like back. <laughs> Thank you so much. So what's next? What are we waiting for the rest of the park? Yeah, so there's a couple things that are still coming. Um, the parkour area is not open yet because it's still under construction. Um, there's a couple of tidbits and tweaks that we're going to definitely be making over the course of the next couple of weeks. The DPW is coming in here all the time to just check out everything and make sure things are in good shape. Um, the hitting wall is on order, so that will be a quick install when it comes in. So that's on its way. Um, those are the big things that I think are still coming. Awesome. Thank you, Carney. And we're ready for summer. Yes, yes. Here we are. Last day of school. First day of officially no school summer. And off we go. Carney, there's a special features you would like to share? Yeah, there's a couple of them. So uh, the fire truck is a nod to the old playground where we had a very much loved fire truck. There was a, a child who used to love playing here who passed away. And uh, his family and his old daycare dedicated a fire truck in his honor. And so it was really important to us to have a fire truck in the new playground. And so that's a little bit of a connection with the old one. And then in the parkour area, when it opens, the design firm recommended that we put in a millstone to give a nod to the areas uh, history of milling and so there's a millstone that you'll be able to check out once the parkour area is open or if you go you can take a look at it now it's a big round stone on the ground awesome hi and we're here with Brandon and team recreation department and design team and we're gonna we are so excited it's so exciting it's finally done it's finally done how exciting is that and there's so many people here. Look at this. What a great turnout. Beautiful day. Everyone's here. We got the pickleball courts full. The basketball court is overflowing with people. The playground's full. It's very exciting. So glad to be here. And ready for summer. So today's the last day of school in Belmont. First day of summer, however you want to view it. And better weather. Perfect. And the course ready for some recreation activities. Yeah, so um, again, today's the grand opening of it. Um, Tim Wong from the Waterfield Design Group um, designed the entire playground and project with a team of, uh, of individuals and a lot of community input. And uh, as of today, it's open for the public, so come down and check it out. Um, we're going to be offering programming here um, on and off, probably more so in the fall. Obviously, it's the summer. We've got the pool and camp and other programming, but there'll be lots of great things coming up soon. Awesome. Tim, what did it take? What was your inspiration for the design? Well, something that took years and years uh, to design and to go through the process. And uh, most of all, we wanted to make something that everyone, uh, old and young, could enjoy, uh, have something for everyone. And if you remember the park from before, it was something that was kind of a sort of an eyesore right on the corner. Um, you know, there's a, the big uh, concrete wall that really blocked everyone's view. So we really wanted to open it up and have somebody for everyone, have it some, be something that can really have the look and feel of Belmont. You know, like in the power core course, you know, have the brick, the logs, the granite, have the look and feel of Belmont, you know, in, in a public park. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you both. Yeah, thank you guys. And uh, as we said a number of times, the park is open. Come on down. It's a beautiful, beautiful area. Um, some aspects of the park are still being completed and will be worked on in the coming weeks. Um, but right now the park is open and ready for use. Come on down. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys. And I'm here with Dave Rogers, the state representative. What a beautiful day. Unbelievable. That You couldn't ask for better weather. People are in a great mood. It's a great day for Belmont. Uh, obviously this has been years in the making so it really is wonderful and now you see all these beautiful pickleball courts the craftsmanship and the quality of the work you can see you know uh, I play tennis myself quite a bit and you know so I get used to seeing lots of different surfaces and these are just really well done so it's a great resource for the town it's awesome it's fantastic and here we are with Melissa, Jackie, Amy, and Anne. And I see you love pickleball. We Woo! love it. What do you share? What do you think about the court? They're beautiful. They're absolutely gorgeous. So excited that they're finally open. Yeah, I agree. We're gonna have a lot of fun here this summer. Oh, uh, really fun to be here with everybody in this beautiful playground and we love the pickleball courts and Belmont was awesome because they got a lot of community involvement in the decision making so it's going to be a lot of fun this summer for us adult kids. 
and for the kids too. That's right. And families. So, yeah. How long have you been playing pickleball? Uh, for you know three years. Yeah, with all my friends, it's really fun. You feel like a little kid going out to the playground to see who's there. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. And I'm here with Ed Barker. Ed, beautiful day and a beautiful park. What do you think? It's a beautiful day in a beautiful park. It's, uh, I know this project has been in the works for a long time. We've sort of watched it over time, and it's really fantastic to have a nice new place like this for kids to play. How many children do you have? So I've got two girls. This is my five-year-old, and I have an eight-year-old who's very jealous that she can't be here this evening. But um, I'm sure we'll be back. Awesome. Thank you. Enjoy the park. Thanks very much. Have a great Come day. Come enjoy the new playground. We are on Beach and Waverly. Townfield Park. Thank you all for watching. That's it for today. I'm your host, Maribel Carvajal de Salazar. See you next time.